It has officially begun. Sagan. What is up, NBA and basketball fans? Yo, the first trade just went down. Yo, the first trade just went down, and it involves my Detroit Pistons. The Detroit Pistons just completed a trade with the Orlando Magic, Brandon Jennings, and Ersan Ilyasova for Tobias Harris. Tobias Harris, the five-year man from Orlando. The Orlando Magic just re-signed Tobias Harris to a four-year 64. Four million dollar deal and they traded him halfway through the season I don't know if this was just a salary dump or if they're just trying to make room for their even younger player But Tobias Harris, he's a, he's a decent player. No, so he can he can hoop a little bit this season His numbers are a little bit down, but it's just because I don't think he's in the right offensive system Will he fit in in Detroit? I don't know. He's averaging 14 and 7 this year 14 points and 7 rebounds Well, the Pistons gave up Brandon Jennings and Ersan Ilyasova. Brandon Jennings can still hoop a little bit. He hasn't looked like himself this season coming off that torn ACL but he was an expiring contract and the Pistons just re-signed Reggie Jackson to that 80 million dollar contract over the offseason so so there's no question that Reggie Jackson is the point guard for the Pistons going forward this move just made that clear so all of you Pistons fans they were hoping that the that the, that the Pistons would trade Reggie Jackson and, and keep Brandon Jennings on the limb that James would re-sign with the Pistons that's out the window Reggie Jackson is here to stay deal with that and as for Ersan Ilyasova I don't really have much to say. He was I. He was drawing them charges. A lot of them, I'm not gonna lie, a lot of them are flops, but he was still drawing them charges, and I'm gonna miss that. But offensively, he was inconsistent. He was mad inconsistent. There'd be some games where he would look great and get you like 20 points on very efficient shooting, and then there were other games where he just wouldn't show up at all. So, you know, it was give or take. You get one good game, then three bad games, then one good game, then three bad games. Tobias Harris is another young player to go with this young Pistons core. It's definitely way too early to tell if Tobias Harris will fit in well. He hasn't played a game. He's gonna be starting at the four. Will he be the starting four of the future for the Detroit Pistons as, as they continue to grow? I don't know. There you have it. That was the first trade of this crazy week and the NBA, the trade deadline week. There could be more trades coming, so just stay tuned for that. I'm gonna try and cover every single trade. Also on Friday, I'm gonna make a recap video of everything that went down and how it affects the league. So make sure to subscribe if you haven't already to see that. But thank you guys, I just jumped in front of the camera really quick. Just, you know, the trade juices got my blood pumping, so I had to make a quick video. And as always, if you like the video, like the video, comment down below what you think about this trade. Make sure to subscribe for more NBA videos and trade updates throughout this week. Keep getting them buckets, Team SDC. Peace. The NBA trade season is here. This is about to be the craziest week in the entire NBA. Nothing but rumors. Rumors everywhere. And one of the main ones this year is around White Goodman, aka Kevin Love, and Carmel Anthony.